beautiful people, we are back and couldn't you believe it? We're playing Dead by Daylight. Who would have guessed that? <laughs> hey guys. Yes. Hey, it look, is, it's, it is, it's becoming course, a channel staple. And yes, this is becoming a channel staple very quickly. And I think at time of recording, we've both got about half a dozen episodes ready to upload. <laughs> I think so, yeah. Roughly. I've got some solo episodes to do and stuff like that. I need to start playing as a killer on solo on my own. I don't have any points for that. I've got Decisive Strike. Whoa. Nicely. Yes, nicely. boy. Yeah, for, yeah. Uh, for Bill. For me, it's decisions, it decisions. Do I stay with Meg or do I go back to the king? Well, that's up to you, man. I mean, I, I think I'm just going to stay with Bill for a bit um, because I've got my, my David, uh, my David, my Dwight, sorry, is up to level 39. So, you know, I've got Meg at level 7, Claudette's level 3, and I don't think I've played with Jake Park or Neil Carlson. David King's level 3 for me. You know what? Let's update my Meg then. I need to actually get the, uh, the DLCs. Yeah, I could do with the DLCs myself. And I'm gonna wait see. until it's like a, a, steel, a Steam sale or something, because they might they may come down in price like on a Steam Steam sale or something. That would be very very useful. I'm loving this new like lobby page there with the twinkly lights and stuff pretty cool it is very very pretty um, the, uh, the blood soaked snowman right no that's still pretty now i'm gonna keep a hold of the flashlight that i stole last episode and i'm gonna switch to one of these common camping aid kits i've got and you know what i'm not really using no one left behind So I'm thinking I'm gonna switch to quick and quiet. That's another one of the perks that I've unlocked. Because I've just spent about twenty five thousand blood points. Nice. I can't wait. I should be able to get uh, decisive strike after this next game with the uh, that should be quite good. You may have to let me know what that one does. Decisive strike. It's when you get you get picked up by the um, killer, um, within a three. I think it's a three or five second period. Like there's like a little hit box that comes up, and you can if you hit the hit box. Oh, that's the one you where you get a, yeah. yeah, that's the one where you get a skill check to see if you can escape the killer's grasp. Yeah, exactly. I have seen it mentioned. Oh, let's go altruism. Sorry, I was just fiddling about. We've got Meg, Quentin, Claudette, and a Bill. Oh, the diversity is amazing, me. An old man. It honestly makes a change. Oh, I forgot. It doesn't tell me. No, so, it didn't tell me either. Just keeping it a secret. You can usually hover over it, it tells you what it is. Well, I recognise there were two lots of flowers, so someone's getting blood points. Yeah, I know. I got uh, I got one for the altruism category. I don't know about you, whether you had any. Yeah, I think same category. I need to get something to sort my wear out on my uh, my stand. I'm gonna have to get some like little tie wraps or something so I can tie wrap it down properly. Keep it straight. Would have been so easy to make a comment of that stuff being straight. Uh -huh. That's very funny. Grim Pantry. Whoop. Oh, I might have thrown the building as well. Nicely, nicely. I am. Um... Especially where a chest is hiding as well. So, let's see if we got anything in here. I'm right by the exit, so if I just sit here while you go do five generators. <laughs> They probably get found. I've got two chests up here. 
Let's have a little look see what we got. Another wraith. Oh god, the wraiths, man. I thought you said the wraith had been nerfed. I think it's just because everything's new on it again. People are seeing if they're any good. Well, maybe. Yeah, that would make sense, to be fair. People tend to like to check stuff out once it's been changed. Ah, uh, went to wrong door. That's it. Good news is the other building has a Jenny in there. And a totem. Well, I just found a green first aid kit. That's pretty cool. Oh, cool. Came in with a brown, leaving with a green. If I escape. Bye bye. Was he trying to take you to the Don't basement? Ask. No idea. Great skill check. Well, I'm on a Jenny in that building that you was near. He escaped him. I'm still running from him. Well, keep running, bro. So, should be some Jenny's popping soon, surely. Ah, he got me. Just about to turn a corner. <laughs> Come on, try and take me to the basement. I dare you. No, straight on a hook. <laughs> oh. I'm pretty close to you. Well, someone's literally was literally stood next to me. Oh, I'm just well, Unfortunately, they've just taken me off way too quick. Really so, you. yeah, he's, he's literally right behind me. Literally got round the corner. And we're in the basement. Just in case this is watching, massive, massive thank you to the guy that got me off of that first hug right in front of the killer. Yeah, that was pretty poor place. Has he gone? I don't know, but that same guy's just got me off the hook again. And he's not but, there, is he? No, still in basement. I swear he's helping Killer, because Killer's not even at him. And I'm dead. Sorry, dude. Oh, it wasn't you that fucked me. No, that wasn't me that fucked you over, dude, but still, it fucking sucks. I can see the killer. <laughs> and there goes my hard earned pit. Shit, I bet the killer's right next to me. Get 
Oh, I got me. Fuck, that was silly. This guy just keeps getting stuck on all the stuff. Good wiggle. Is that Krish? I suppose it's not his fault that Killer's body watching, but... Why didn't Pollock just stay on that Jenny then? I don't know, but this guy's got no skill at all. Like, really, no skill. He obviously doesn't know how to fucking play the game. Because he's got to just stand and body watch people and he hooks them up. <laughs> oh, here's Chris again. Why is he just gonna come after me all the time, like seriously? Because he wants to lower numbers as quick as he can. She's finally doing something useful. What, right, Jenny? Yeah. Finally. Although he's not boxed it, he got a good skill check and then ran off. And he's gone upstairs to where there's already a Jenny turned on. He's not the smartest, is he? Pollock's being chased. Is he? Yeah. It's a good dash, trying to get that Jenny. Oh, yeah, I think I've seen him run past in the distance. They seem to have escaped. Chris is now back on a Jenny. Yeah, I know it's not the same Jenny as oh, me, right? Same Jenny as you. <laughs> oh, it's that's not still, so used to me. Oh, it's still running around. I'm gonna hide in this locker right now. He's coming for ya. That were risky. Don't you fucking dare check the locker, you cunt. Well, he's just kicked to that Jenny. So. Where are the other Jennies? There's like, I think there should be another two or three Jennies around the map somewhere. I don't know, but Pollock's close to one. But he's just kicked it. 
Is that that one that Pollock's close to? Yeah. I don't know why I need to move before the fucking grades get on me. Chris is here in Heartbeats. By the house in the middle. I don't know what I want to be part of doing the last journey, man, to be honest. I like one more hook and I'm dead. And you bet your ass it'll be coming straight for me. Pollock's by an active Jenny. Killer's I close to Pollock. I see him, I see him. He's chasing after Pollock now. Yeah. Uh, It's annoying that I lost a bit though, because I managed two killer escapes and the killer stun. Oh yeah. But still lost a bit because killer just kept on me. Good news is, well he's after Pollock, if it should give you time to do a Jenny. Well I've just got on one now, but it's like one of the hardest Jennies to do because it's right in the open. It's just took Pollock down. Distance yeah, away from you, so. But if I leave Pollock on the hook and let that other guy get him. Yeah, uh, you just focus on doing that journey. Pollock's right next. Uh, Pollock's by that other guy. Let's hope he doesn't come back for the journeys, though. Let's hope he's not that smart. Oh, he's escaped. Legend. Don't run towards me, Pollock, no. Take him away from the Jennies. Oh, Pollock, you do not know what you're doing to me right now. Yes, pick her up, take her. Again. Nice. Well, I've nearly done this journey now. And there's a, uh, an exit right behind me. I've <laughs> got Pollock again. Chris seems to be. Close to Pollock, though. Well, that's Pollock's first hook, so. And Krish is stood behind the killer. The killer's just stood watching Pollock. Oh, is it? Yeah. Where's the other Jenny? Oh, where's the other exit? I don't know, but the killer was literally just stood watching Pollock. So Krish couldn't save her. As Chris he's went just, up. He's had to. Killer's just sat camping body. And I mean, he's li he's not even close. He's just stood there hitting a weight. Wait, where? Well, I'm just opening the other escape hatch now. Doing it for the point. I think he might be going back in to try and do a YOLO save. Possible. Like his killer's downstairs and just hit Krish. Pollock's currently struggling and getting hit again. He's healing himself. Krish, we're not. Krish is at the bottom, healing himself up. Killer's stood right in front of Pollock.
run him into fresh. Yeah, yeah, but there's no else to run him. And now, if you turn right, there's another stairwell round back. I can't hear myself fully, though, as always, the first aid kit. But... Just leave. <laughs> This one has the extra points, man. That wasn't a bad game for me. That sucks that you died so early, but that, that guy was like so bad. It's just like rep. Congratulations, you've just earned a rep being a dumbass. But still, yeah, I got a decent amount of points for that, I'm not gonna really complain, so kinda of decisive strike on the go. Fill up to level 9. We've got power flashlight. I've been going to afford the flashlight right now. Anyway guys, I think that's enough for this episode. I know it's a short one today, um, but I hope you had fun. If you did indeed enjoy the episode, do leave a like. Slap that good old subscribe button. It does indeed help us out obviously uh just lets us know that we're making half decent content for you guys and yeah we'll catch you in the next one peace Toodles.